What if Wolverine, with his regeneration power, was thrown into a black hole? Would he still get spaghettified or would he just continually regenerate? Here's the thing. The spaghettification, unless you're elastic man, splits you into pieces. Well, if, if I split you at the base of your spine, that's well, likely the first place you'll break. And then at the base of your neck and then at your knees and your hips, then he's Wolverine in eight parts. What does it mean to regenerate that? I don't even know. Yeah, you can't. Because there's, there's a gap in between. between. The, exactly from what I've seen in the movies and in right. the comic book, the regeneration requires that the, the gaps are filled that are part of your body, mm -hmm. and it fills in from where you already had flesh. That's true. Even the adamantium, adamantium. Um, a black hole will overcome any physical any substance. Any physical substance? Correct. No wow. matter what it is. So even, he's, even, he's still, even if it's fictional and magical, right, it'll it's overcome. Still, it's still going to break. Right. It's still going to end up because, being just a stream of what? Single atoms? Correct. Now, do the atoms actually get spaghettified? Yes. Too? Wow. This is my point. The nuclei get even, spaghettified. Wow. This is, my, this is why I'm saying. So what happens is the tidal force of gravity, that's the stretching force. Right. Tides. That's where we get the word tides from. The tidal force of gravity becomes greater than all other forces of nature. Period. Period. Nice. So the forces of nature that hold the molecules together, that hold the atoms together, right. that hold the nuclei together, get ripped apart by the tidal forces of gravity. Oh, wow. Okay. That's so why he, gravity wins. Right. So he's, yeah. he's spaghettified.